What's up guys, welcome to my channel once again and this video is going to be very interesting as you know due to coronavirus nowadays there is a big demand for hand sanitizers and a lot of other companies they are making it but the one i'm going to review in this video is something different and something very interesting and in this video i'm going to review hand sanitizers from the house of al haramain al haramain is a very famous house and i'm sure all of you have already know about it their perfumes are very famous all over the world and if you are looking for very loud perfumes which projects like beast then you can check with Al Haramain. Al Haramain have launched six hand sanitizers in total, out of which three of them they are regular hand sanitizers. But the three I'm going to show you in this video they are uh, high end and the most expensive ones. And the range we are going to discuss in this video is this. In this range, they got three different fragrances. I will show you uh, one by one and I will try to explain you. Uh, how they smell and what's so special in these hand sanitizers. So let's start our review with the presentation. And as you can see here, this is a very nice, good box. The quality and finish is very decent here. From the packaging, no one can say that this is a hand sanitizer. Uh, they will give you a look of perfume. And now let me show you the bottle. See, a very nice uh, frosted bottle. There are a total of three bottles of different colors and different fragrances and the quality and the finish is very good. So the question why we are discussing hand sanitizers on my channel. So let me tell you something. They are multitaskers. They are not only hand sanitizers. Uh, you can use them in different ways. First of all, the first use of this product as you can see from the name is sanitizing your hands and your dresses. But these sanitizers, they are a perfume at the same time. Uh, they are as good as any good perfume available in the market. This one is musk and as you can see from the name, this is pure white musk. It will give you a very fresh musky soapy feel and especially for the summers it will work like magic. So this is the musk and now let's go to the other fragrance which is Udi. As you can see from the name and from the bottle, uh, this smell is Oud based. For the notes breakdown you can go and check their website but here I will try to explain you how this actually smells. I have applied it already on my hand. Wow this is very nice very beautiful fragrance. This is very fresh. This is very sweet. You will get a hint of rose. You will get smoke hair. You will get woody notes and you will find a very beautiful note of leather. Uh, if you guys love Tuscan leather from Tom Ford uh, the same smell of leather you will find here and you will also find labdanum, musk and amber in this perfume and in the dry down you will get very beautiful musky tones, woody tones along with a very little bit uh, of oud. From the notes breakdown you might be thinking that because of leather, smoke, uh, woody notes, oud and amber and labdanum uh, maybe this product is not suitable for the summers but believe me this is a very fresh take on a woody fragrance very easy to wear in summer and you will enjoy it uh, you must give it a try to this product and now let's come to our last fragrance which is amber and very beautiful uh, purple color of bottle this fragrance is also very amazing uh, very nice very beautiful wow again a very fresh take on oriental perfumes very nice very good uh, i will try to explain you how this smells uh, in the opening you will get bergamot orange rose you will find uh, powderiness from oris there is a very light hint of saffron uh, you will find some woody notes uh, which are coming from cedar and a very beautiful amber and incense uh, incense is very prominent in this perfume and there is also uh, some white sweet uh, woody notes here which is coming from the kaik wood and there is also a very light beautiful hint of vanilla and in the dry down you will experience very beautiful incense musk amber and some uh, woody notes a uh, little bit uh, spicy but again a very fresh take on a spicy perfume as i have told you these are sanitizers but perfume at the same time so that means you can also use these products on your clothes okay and as you know when we go outside of course we touch different things so that's why uh, we are in a need of hand sanitizer to sanitize our hands but if you think 
it's not only the hands which are going to touch uh, different objects outside uh, also our elbows sometimes we put our elbows on the counters and also our dresses they are coming in contact uh, with different things so sanitizing of our clothes are also very important until now the products available in the market uh, they are good uh, as you can see uh, most of the sanitizers they are coming in the gel form uh, gels you cannot apply on your clothes of course you can use them only on your hands and gel is not even good uh, to put on your door knobs or on different surfaces to clean them uh, but here because this is a spray form you can use it easily on your clothes and these perfumes they are very beautiful and very long lasting on my dress this perfume give me 10 to 12 hours uh, plus longevity and a very good projection for the first one and a half to two hours this one projects like a beast uh, first one and a half to two hours it will give you very nice and good projection even on your skin these are going to stay for a very long time which is not happening with other sanitizers on my skin this gives me more than five to six hours of performance and even uh, washing my hands twice i was still able to smell uh, the beautiful scents of these uh, products so this was about uh, the dresses and hands and of course one more very good very great use of this product uh, i'm sure most of you guys they are using uh, deodorants you will find 70 percent alcohol content in these products the minimum benchmark set for a sanitizer from the government is 60 percent any sanitizer in the market it should have a minimum of 60 percent alcohol uh, otherwise uh, you cannot sell it as a sanitizer because it will lose that antiseptic uh, qualities so here in this product you will find 70 percent of alcohol uh, believe me because of the antiseptic qualities of these products you can use it as a deodorant and believe me guys i have tested it for the last two days and they are very good or at least equally good to a very famous uh, deodorants available in the market it will give you more than 10 to 12 hours of protection so this is like a three in one kind of product you can sanitize your hands you can use it as a perfume on your dress and you can also use these products as a deodorant and you will enjoy you will never regret you guys must give a try to these uh, products uh, and these are absolutely unisex guys uh, girls ladies gents anyone can use them without any hesitation and they can pull it off easily and for the age group any age even teenagers they are going to enjoy uh, these scents and now let's talk about the price the price of these all perfumes are same you can buy any of them it will cost you the same the price of this perfume is 47.760 dirham without watt and with watt i think it will be around 50 to 51 dirham i think so in the price of around 50 dirham you will get 100 ml of sanitizer perfume deodorant a three-in-one product from the house of al ramed on the other hand the regular normal sanitizers available in the market they starts from 20 to 25 dirham and uh, their fragrance will not stay on your hand or on your skin uh, for more than two to three minutes that's it so this was the review for al haramain's uh, perfume sanitizers i hope you like it uh, see you in the next video until then bye and take care